Welcome to 6th grade orientation, Intro to Core 4, where you will become familiar with the four domains for promoting school and student success. During this portion of your orientation, we will focus time identifying and defining each of the domains and how they relate to you. What is Core 4? Core 4 is a set of values that we believe in. Self-confidence, growth mindset, responsible behavior, service to others. Emphasizing these characteristics in your daily lives will equip you with skills for being successful at Waldron Middle School and Waldron High School. It will prepare you to be successful beyond the walls of the school and help you become the best version of yourself. The first of the four domains is self-confidence. I pose two questions. What is self-confidence and how can you apply self-confidence to your schoolwork and school activities? Self-confidence is an attitude about your skills and abilities. It means you accept and trust yourself and have a sense of control in your life. To have self-confidence in school is to have self-acceptance. Identify your strengths and weaknesses from a place of understanding. Use your strengths and weaknesses to focus on achievements and, and set manageable goals and experience the positivity that you can achieve in school. Be confident. Gandhi once said, If I have the belief that I can do it, I shall surely acquire the capacity to do it even if I may not have it in the beginning. Our second domain is growth mindset. Growth mindset means that you work hard daily to grow in mind and body. Growth mindset is a positive way of thinking that leads to academic and personal growth. As we discussed self-confidence, we talked about setting goals and attaining those goals. Growth mindset is creating the mindset that you can do whatever you put your mind to, accomplishing things that you once could not or did not. Growth mindset is trying new things, an attitude towards learning and growing that gets you in the mindset of challenging yourself and accomplishing your goals. It means breaking away from habits of a fixed mindset, of sticking to what you know or are comfortable with, and quitting when things get tough. Growth mindset helps us to build the mental capacity to accomplish great things. Our third domain is responsible behavior, referring to how we treat others with honor and respect and how we behave on a daily basis. When talking about responsible behavior, we want you to consider the idea of consciously making decisions about your own conduct in a way that improves your own self and helps others. We want you to promote the well-being of those around you on a daily basis. Build up those around you. We don't want our students to feel torn down or defeated. A lot of that can begin with the way you treat others on a daily basis. Treat each other with respect and kindness and accept the responsibility and consequences for your own actions. Consequences are often portrayed as having a negative impact. But consequences can be positive. Positive consequences can be praise of one's doings, or positive consequences can be that good feeling you have inside when you have done the respectful, responsible thing in the given circumstance. Which would you prefer? Michael E. DeBakey once said, Real success requires respect for and faithfulness to the highest human values. Honesty, integrity, self-discipline, dignity, compassion, humility, courage, personal responsibility, courtesy, and human service. Our fourth and final domain, service to others. Albert Einstein once said that only a life lived in service to others is a life worth living. Well, what does service to others mean? It means being unselfish. It means doing something for someone else without expecting any reward or gain. It can mean helping someone out when they cannot complete a task on their own. It is the responsible thing to do as a human, another student, another person, sharing time here at Waldron Junior Senior High. Think about the many ways that you can help others on a daily basis at school. Helping pick up drop books and papers, opening doors for someone with full hands. It may even be as simple as giving someone a compliment, a shoulder to lean on when they are having a bad day. Service to others is a lifestyle, a mindset, a good habit. It is a way of living not only for your own benefit, but for the benefit of all whom you come in contact with on a daily basis. Core 4 Student Recognition Here at Waldron, we like to recognize students that exemplify those values that we hold valuable to our mission. Each month, we challenge teachers and staff to nominate students for recognition for going above and beyond to display Core 4 values. If you are a selected recipient of this achievement, you earn a certificate, a shirt, and recognition on the school website and social media sites. We encourage you to strive daily to display these values in all that you do and hope to see your names in the nominations in the coming months. As we planned for 6th grade orientation, we, cre we created some activities for students to participate in that would begin the process of thinking with a core 4 mindset. 
We hope that you are able to complete these activities with your child in preparation for sixth grade. Any activities that require a specific worksheet will have the required worksheet provided. Other items are household items that may be found in your homes. The following is a list of available organizations and a brief description of those organizations that are found in the school that provide opportunities for serving others in the school and community. Student Council is a group of students that represent the student body and organizes events and fundraisers. The FFA is a club that provides an agricultural experience that serves the community in many ways including planting of gardens and flower beds as well as attending conventions and sharing their ag ideas. NHS is an honorable society that represents those that work hard and perform well in academic tasks and achievements. SAD is Students Against Destructive Decisions is a group that helps spread the word and provide resources about harmful decisions that students may experience. The Sunshine Society is a group that completes fundraising for community organizations and are often responsible for planning school activities and dances. Future Business Leaders of America do fundraising for the school and build on college and career readiness while fostering a mindset and skill base necessary for a future in business.